Today, we are kicking off FIFA 23 Squad Builder Showdown with a prank. We are, of course, on FIFA 23, where the chemistry is absolutely mental. If you want to know how it's going to work for Squad Builder Showdown, please refer back to this earlier video. But we are here. We've got Vinicius Jr., who costs an absolute bomb. And there's two things I need for a prank. A sick squad, which I'm going to build myself, and a victim, which is a Tawny. I'm going to pretend I have got the perfect grasp on the new chemistry and know exactly what Atani's going to do at every stage of the squad by telling them I've guessed basically every single one of his players. I might let him have one or two just so he doesn't get too suspicious, but his centre-backs are going, he's not having a good midfield, his attack's going to be ruined with a goalkeeper up front, we're going to obliterate him, hopefully beat him 11-0 and make him discard his Vinicius Jr. Well, we might stop just before he discards his Vinicius Jr. because it's the start of FIFA and he's like 300k, that'd be a, maybe a little bit too mean even for me, but we'll make him think that he's going to and make him cry about it just because it's funny. So the next thing you'll hear is me doing the actual intro to the actual squad that showdown because if we don't have an actual intro, he'd get very suspicious of what is going on. So we're going to pretend it's a normal video, but me and you, we know the prank is coming. Let's get into it. What's up, everybody? And welcome to the first Squad Builder Showdown of FIFA 23. We are joined by the only man in the world who could possibly understand this chemistry enough to build a hybrid. It is the hybrid master himself, the one and only Cheetah Tarni. Safe to say hybrids are gone for the year. What do you mean hybrids are gone? You've never <laughs> built a hybrid in your life and you're never going to anyway. So this, I thought, what better man to do Squad Builder Showdown with at the start where nobody understands the chemistry? It's the man who just builds a one league team anyway. So. It doesn't matter for him. Just crack on as normal, Atani. It's basically FIFA 22, mate. Yeah, but the same Premier League. <laughs> the same Premier League, and it ain't French, so you're kind of muddled. I personally think I've got quite a good grasp of the chemistry already, so I reckon I'm going to be living rent-free in your head. I mean, we'll see. I mean, it's going to be interesting to see how the guessing is going to be. That's what I'm more interested in, because it's so easy to move away from the obvious, if that makes sense. That's true, but you have to bring it back to the obvious in order to get them yeah. all onto full chemistry, so... Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how the year players out what he is going to do with the chemistry because for SBCs especially that's been so annoying already. Yeah it's a little bit mud. It's annoying doing the basic ones but it's good for the expensive ones because you can just put a few players in. Say you want to get an 86 rated squad. Say you want to get an 86 rated squad with 10 chem or something like that. You can just put some players in to get 10 chemistry and then put the cheapest possible high rated players in any positions and it doesn't matter. Yeah. Whereas in previous FIFAs you had to link them all together and buy screeny art and Chiellini, and they cost loads of coins because they link to each other, so... That is true. But, you know what I realized? The position modifiers do not sell those. You will need them for SBCs throughout yes. the year. That's going to be so important. The other thing to say about secondary positions as well, Atani, is we are going to be playing today by the rules of Squabble the Showdown that I laid out as the default in the video the other day. Go back and check it out if you want to see how that how it's all going to work. Going forward, I think they are going to be subject to change, and we don't know exactly how it's going to work until we've done a few episodes of it. The thing that I'm leaning towards changing already and that you guys are saying in the comment section is secondary positions. So I said you can have any secondary position that you would have already been able, always been able to do in Squabble Showdown. So like left wing to left mid, that's fine. Camp to centre mid, that's fine if they can do it. But it's the ones like Gabriel Jesus, striker to right wing. It's a bit all over the place. And I said you can have one of them or an icon or a hero. However, you guys seem to like the idea of it. So maybe we'll change it going forward. So you can have an icon and a hero and a secondary position. But for now, we're going to play with the rules that I've already set out, the default rules, and we'll see as time progresses. All also, big shout out to FopMob for once again being the official partners of FIFA 23 Squad Builder Showdown. Did you see the Sidemen match, Atani? I did. Did you see the Sidemen matches on FopMob and that Mini Minter was only the second player in FopMob history to get a 10 out of 10? Wow. Infamous FopMob, 10 out of 10. Three goals, three assists, I think he got absolutely bossed it. If you guys want to go and download FopMob, you don't just keep up with charity YouTube football matches. You can keep up with all of the football. They've just updated to get new widgets for the new iOS, which is very, very nice as well. And you can just keep track of all of the leagues, the fixtures, the goal scorers, the in-game stats, everything. There's a link down below. Atani. Yes. First guess of FIFA 23, mate. The formation. What formation do you want? <laughs> I'm going to go with 4 3 3 2 Okay. I feel like I prefer the CDM. I put 4 3 2 1, so you can have it. Okay. I myself am not going to play the 4 3 2 1 that I wrote. Wait a second. Oh my God. What? You can't even play him in 4. I'm so stupid. You can't play him in 4 3 2 1. What? One sec. It's got center forwards. I'll have 4 3 3. They changed it. I wrote that for you as well. <laughs> Did you actually? <laughs> yeah. You're as stupid oh, as me. No. You always <laughs> picked it last FIFA, that's the thing. <laughs> wow. Mate. <laughs> 
This is not off to a good start. <laughs> it's already over for us. <laughs> You're as stupid as I am. <laughs> oh dear. Well, I'll have four free free then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> That's interesting, though. 4 3 2 1 now as center forward. So you can play like three strikers up front. That is interesting. But it's a nice change, in my opinion. I might try that out now that I found out it's three strikers. You never know. Just not with Vinicius because he's a left wing yeah. or left mid. <laughs> <laughs> Unless. Does he have an alternate position? No, he doesn't. Just oh, left okay. wing, left mid. <laughs> yeah, we asked him. Because that could have worked. <laughs> okay, should we jump in then? Striker and right wing? Let's do it. <laughs> Into the first section we go then. Would you like the honours for FIFA 23, Atani? You know what? I'll take it. Who are you going for? All right. So first things first, I was looking at the strikers. There is a couple of good ones, but some of them are a bit too obvious. So I went to centre forward, Jao Felix. And then for my right winger, less obvious, Chakaweezy. Sorry, what did you just say? Chakaweezy. Chakaweezy. Yeah. Jacques Weezy. Yeah. Am I losing my mind? So C H U K. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Sure. You can have him. What about Felix? You see that Joe Felix Atani? Get oh, no him. Way. Are you actually the serious? Hell? Oh my. Out of here. Wait, you changed the rules anyway, right? It took one for one, <laughs> mate. One go, one player. See you later. Thank you very much. Before you give me my player, tell me who you want. Okay, I also put Felipe Anderson, which when you were like, oh, I'm going to go on obvious, I was like, holy <laughs> sorry, yeah, go on, go on. <laughs> for the purposes of the squad building as well, with the new rules, you can keep Jao Felix in your team because if you have an exclamation mark, it doesn't give a link because I have about to give you a goalie, mate. <laughs> but you can keep him there for the stars and stuff and then you can put your goalie on the bench and before we go into the All match, right. put the goalie in. That makes sense. But you want to know who I want first? Go on. Are you ready for this? I don't think you're ready for this. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sitting down? Oh, obviously I'm not going to be standing up recording. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, you could be knowing you. I reckon you just get past the top of the desk. Are you braced? Are you ready? Diego Forlan! Oh! What? He's going all out. He's actually going all out. What the hell? And Lucas Mora, please. Wow. You could obviously have them. It's over for you, Atani. <laughs> it is over for you. I don't You've even got have no a striker. striker. And you're playing against Diego Forlan. I mean, that doesn't New matter. hero. <laughs> Me having no striker doesn't matter. I'm playing against Fallen yet. So. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> yeah. mate. You're scoring no goals and I'm scoring loads. I have Vinicius Jr., mate. Let's see if we can find some nice spicy And new... don't forget about Tchaikovsky. Stop saying <laughs> random names. It changes everything. <laughs> don't forget about Chikorito, mate. <laughs> Every time we mention this. Don't forget about Kialuni. <laughs> oh, my God. Right, would you like... <laughs> would you like a Portuguese goalie from the from La Liga? Or were you just sort of picking randomly and I can find you a funny bronze player? A La Liga player is fine. Just La Liga? With a good name. Can... <laughs> right. <laughs> if they ever introduce women into Ultimate Team, this is what you would shout. Put her in your team and make her quick. Well, what, what's the name? Make her. <laughs> Get her the hell in there and make her quick. <laughs> Shall we move on? <laughs> Let's do it. Into the midfield we go then. My turn to go first before we find out who you're pairing up with your Chiesa. Yeah. I'm going to go Bruno Fernandes. I do need a link to Lucas Moura in order to get chemistry. So I'm going to go for Spurs' new signing, Basuma. Just to clarify for the people as well, these secondary positions are okay because it's one either side of their default. I've lost my crazy secondary position because I've used Forlan, which is my icon or hero. So you can go like camp to centre mid, CDM to centre mid, but I couldn't be going left back to centre back or something like that. Just so, just so you know, Atani. Anyway, in the middle, I'm going to round it off with a Brazilian from the Prem. It's going to be West Ham's new signing, Lucas Paqueta. Cost myself about 6k worth of position changes here, but we move. <laughs> you could have them. Oh. So this Beautiful. is what I did. Go on. Alan. Okay. Fabinho. Okay. And Rice. So you basically went full Brazilian prep yeah. <laughs> and I picked the one. I yeah. guess you didn't put Casemiro or Fred. No, didn't expect you to pick them. Very nice. Very nice. Who would you like? Okay, so for me, I'm going to go with a legend that used to play for Spurs, the Chelsea. Next one is Perejo. I don't know how obvious this is, this one, though. I am pretty sure you've written it down. Who is it? I'm going to go with Lamar. 
That is a man with some very saucy secondary, position, secondary positions, actually. You can play left mid and right mid as well as center mid, I think, can't he? Yeah, that's why I use them. Can he play for you, Atani? He can. Nice. I put Marino, Chuameni, and Lo Celso. Did you actually? I did. Two for two, baby. I figured I've just picked um, Kessie. That's who I wanted. Oh, Barcelona Kessie? Oh, yeah. Man doesn't even know he exists. <laughs> I'm guessing your players by being stupid. What a day. What a time to be alive. I told you, mate, I've got this new chemistry unlock. Your defense is so mudded. It's unbelievable. Yep. I say I've got this chemistry unlock like you haven't just picked six La Liga players, <laughs> but still. <laughs> right, you've got Lamar. Okay, that's smart. It gives a chemistry point to your Jao Felix. Maybe I should have thought of that. You've got Parejo. Gives a chemistry point to Chuck Norris. <laughs> 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 Maybe I should have wrote it. Okay, I see. See, we're getting ideas of the chemistry. And then exactly. you don't have low Celso. You can have a lovely bronze La Liga player. This one can nice. actually go in because it's going to be a centre mid. You can have a bit of a squabble to show down legend, mate. Al Gobia. He's had an absolutely whopping three pace downgrade from FIFA 22. Very nice. Oh, dear. Should we move on to the fullbacks? Let's do it. Into the fullbacks we go then. Your turn to go first again, Atani. All right. Carver Howe. Okay. You know you've got full chemistry on all of your players, Atani. I do, but... We're just carrying on with La Liga anyway? You never know. Okay, <laughs> sure. Jordi Alba. Bloody hell. He's going all out. What's the damage? None. Let's go. Finally. Finally. Didn't think you had that in you. But did you write? Gaia. Yeah. And Lucas Vasquez. So I was close. I was close with the car for help, but I went I went stinky because it's you. You can actually have so you've survived a round of Tawny. Thankfully, and I need it because of your wingers, so. True, true. But you need your centre back as well, because I've got Diego Forlan, mate. That as well. And my goalkeeper, but yeah. Do you know who I want? Go on. Left back. Jordi Alba, mate. Okay. And right back. Jesus Navas. I'm going all out. I put Cancelo. Okay. And Samida. Nice. <laughs> okay. Damn, Te didn't pay off. Didn't pay off. Technically, I couldn't use Cancelo at right back because I've already used Diego left Forlan. Left back, left back. Yeah, but he is a left back, but he can play right back, can't he? But if we add in the... Let me know what you think in the comment section. Do you think we should be allowed to have an icon and a hero and one secondary position? Do you think the secondary position should count as your icon and a hero? Or do you think you should be able to just have unlimited secondary positions and then an icon or hero? Let me know. Unlimited secondary position would be impossible. Do you reckon? Yeah, <laughs> because there's some centre mids that could be centre backs and so on. Yeah, so it can get a little bit crazy and maybe hard to guess. But I guess as we go through the year, you might get a bit more used to them. The extra confusion would come in. Well, A, part of the fun of Squabble the Showdown is guess and the other person's players. So I don't want to make it too hard. Otherwise, the series would be boring because, you know, it's about being entertaining. But also, as the year goes on, I don't know what EA are going to do with shapeshifters and Champions League cards. It might be like, hey, it's a Champions League card that can play anywhere across the front line and then you're just sort of muddled for guessing, you know? Yeah. So I think maybe one secondary and one icon or hero could be a good middle ground. But let me know in the comments and we'll move on to the final stage. <laughs> Two whole hours later, because the EA servers died, we are back and we are finally going to do the centre-backs and the goalie, the most important parts. It's the first final stage with the new chem system, so let's see. I need chemistry for Basuma and Paqueta and two stars for Bruno Fernandes. Let's get into it. Left centre-back, I am going in form Saliba. 80 pace, mate. Right centre back. I am going. Canate. 78 pace, mate. Sweaty, sweaty defenders. And in goal, to get that final little bit of chemistry for Bruno Fernandes, I've got two options David De Gea or Jose Sar. And I'm going to bottle it and go Jose Sar. Who is that? The Wolves goalie, mate. I know, but come on. Who did you put? Ruben Diaz. Okay. Diego Carlos. Okay. De Gea. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Wow. That was close. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> I was on the right track, though. Holy. Who would you like? I'm going to go with Laporte. Aspele. Kepa. Wow. <laughs> Laughs at me and then picks Aspel Equator. What do you mean? Chelsea legend? Man's got 64 <laughs> pace, 82 non-rare stinky squads. I thought the whole Chelsea squad is non-rare. Wow, well that's me. <laughs> Kepper is also 80 rated non-rare. Yeah, but have you seen his height? 6-1. <laughs> and Laporte is 86 rated walkouts, to be fair. Exactly. Do you know what I put on my whiteboard? Go on. You went La Liga, mate. Kula Bali. Ooh, Serie A. Interesting. 
Actually, no, no Premier League. No, one. Chelsea. I forgot. I forgot. I for Chelsea. <laughs> Cooler Barley. Why would Laporte. you pick? Did you actually? I did. How could you get chemistry attorney to cool a barley and Laporte? David De Gea. So you didn't pick Kepa. But I know it's you. So you see that Kepa. Get your stinky ass squads out of there, mate. What do you think this is? That's the most attorney. As, as Pillar Quater is a have new low. I literally picked just Lord Eagle. As Pillar Quater <laughs> is a new low attorney. Even you don't usually pick 64 paced non rare centre backs. But coming in with your little, oh, but I'll have an 80 rated non rare goalie in the first squad of the show. That's the most attorney thing in the possible world. I am a genius. How are you feeling? Down. <laughs> well, that just makes me feel mean. <laughs> so, one of your midfielders that you gave me doesn't go and see the M, so... Well, whilst I'm finding you a terrible, terrible centre-back combo, I'll get you a terrible, terrible centre-mid as well. Or CDM. Don't worry, mate. I'll sort you out. You can have Johnny Alamo. Do you know what? I've been really nice to you because he's got a whopping 30 more pace than Al Gobbia. Centre-back, you can have John Donald. Is he a rare? Is he a rare? Absolutely not, mate. And an in-goal, Ruli Garcia, 54 rated. Wow, you gave me plays that don't even get me full chem on Aspele. I feel like this is going to be something that we're going to encounter quite a lot, especially with once you put your trump cards back in instead of Jao Felix. I don't, I don't think that'll affect it this time because you've got so many La Liga players, but in future episodes, it might. So I reckon the best thing to do is probably just to play Max Chem. So I guess it doesn't matter because we're going to play Max Chem. Anyway, and you can keep your horrendous, stinky bronze players, mate. Half my team is bronze. First game. Have you played any FIFA 23? No. Me neither. But that's a lie. If but not you really. lose, you should be embarrassed. And when you lose, you're going to lose 11-0 and discard Vinicius. <laughs> Let's get into it. So good. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It is now the next day because the servers come back up. We managed to finish building the squad and then they had a meltdown again because everyone else realized that they'd come back up. So finally, third time of asking, we get to play our first game of Squad Builder Showdown FIFA 23 against the Tawny's beautiful, stinky squad with Diego Forlan. Look at that finish nice against goal. the bronze keeper. Nice. Goal. I didn't even, I've got to be honest, I didn't even mean that. What's this shooting? Enough to score past the bronze, mate. Oh, that was a ball. Surely against the bronzy. Oh, it's nice. too easy, mate. Nice. Are we about to get the first 11 nil in the <laughs> first game? Oh, what a ping. What oh, a what save. a save from the bronze. What a save. Holy. Finish that. Oh, my God. What mate, the hell? So <laughs> bad. <laughs> it is a bronze. <laughs> that was not where I was aiming at all. No way! Oh Tramp goals God. against friends. Wow. What Didn't realize that was the depth suite. That was a crazy <laughs> save. Ref! Oh my God, are you messing? No! You make me <laughs> sick. <laughs> the comeback! No mercy in the second half. I'm doing leaning forward. Come on, Diego Forland. That's Donald. <laughs> <laughs> you know that Jeez. Zoom thing is such a meme? <laughs> He is so bronze. <laughs> oh, surely. Nice. Mate, this Diego Forlan shooting. I, he is against the bronze goalie, yeah, actually. I was going to say, it's so good. <laughs> that was a saucy little finish, though. Go on, Lucas. Nice. <laughs> that centre-back is killing me because he keeps outpacing them. That was Jordi Alba. Was it? Yeah. What a goal from Chikorito. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Just one more and I get to say the immortal phrase. Oh, okay. <laughs> Didn't get to say a date to be you, but I still would hate to be you because you've got five discards, mate. Oh my God. Bronze keepers just power shopping. Basically. Super shot if you get the space. Or if you're a goalkeeper, just cross. Or if half the team is bronze. <laughs> <laughs> I'm switching all the players around now. Okay. Let me know when you're ready. Yeah, I'm ready. Left back! Okay. You've actually got a lot of bronze players to be hitting. Left center mid. Left wing. Striker. Goalie. Okay. You got Donald Duck, <laughs> Almo, the fake one. 
the Chelsea the legend Mako so you got three bronzes surprisingly oh you did hit Vinicius Jr yes come on what a start how'd you feel pretty bad because he's just like let me see how much he is right now this is the second day I haven't seen his price 300k right now that's how much he's going for it's like a thousand pounds <laughs> yeah pretty much <laughs> well Atani yep. go and get him in SBC Yep. Is what I'd say if this wasn't a prank. What? Didn't guess any of your players, mate. Wait, so... <laughs> what? Actually, that's not strictly true. Because I did actually guess Lo Celso and Laporte by myself on the whiteboard anyway. But the rest of the time, I was just writing like LOL on the whiteboard or <laughs> RIP centre back and goalkeeper. <laughs> oh my god. You know what? It's, it's, it's actually kind of bittersweet because I get to save my Vinicius Jr. now. But this is true. This one. You just got clowned. <laughs> I was excited to play. Woo! Well, there will be another squabbler shadow normally over on Atani's channel. Go and check it out. That was fun. I wow. couldn't quite bring myself to make it actually just go Vinicius at the start of FIFA. Yeah, it is expensive to be fair. That 300k. And actually, when you when I, when you found out, I actually kind of just felt bad. Thought you were gonna like fume or something like that. I was like, how would you feel? And you're like, sad. <laughs> yeah, because. It is. I mean, the chance of you getting it is quite high just because you had so many picks. You I know guess. What I mean? When I discarded Kante, I was nearly in tears, mate. <laughs> Holy, that is so good. Well, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. We'll be Woo! back with more actual Squabble Showdowns. But for now, I'll see you next time. Peace.